Hello, good afternoon, everyone. This is Ace One. Hi, how are you? How is everyone doing? Hey. So let's start with today's uh, topic over here. All right. Uh, before that, Happy May Day. Okay. All right. Let's start. So today I'm just covering and sharing with you. Okay. Um, conducting viewing from the comfort of your home using technology is possible. You still can conduct your business from the comfort of your home. All right. Okay. So let's take a look. So first of all, we under, understand COVID-19. Okay, so uh, with the current uh, circuit breaker regulation, real estate activities is considered as non-essential. Okay, so what happens means that visiting a client's property or show flat is not allowed. Okay, so show flat all closed already. Zip, hold it out. All right, so you cannot even uh, go to your client's uh, property to see, oh, I want to see a house, your rooms, everything, cannot. Right. So in that case, then how do we actually uh, continue our business? Okay. So these are uh, some sharing here. Okay. Using technology, meaning what? First of all, market yourself. Okay. How do we do marketing yourself? Um, I believe right now, okay, uh, positive mindset definitely must be there. Okay. And at the same time, you besides marketing the property that you have on your hand, okay, you also need to market yourself. Right, so you you need to use uh, the property that your listings that you have to market yourself as well. Right, later I will show you some of uh, the methods I do, things I do. Okay, so uh, property guru reposting, create new listings. Okay, reposting. A lot of agents now forget, stop totally, stop. Okay, uh, reposting. Some of them they the listing expire already, but I'm sure later on end of this month just before the 1st of June, then they start post reposting again or uh, posting back uh, in the listing again. Uh, but right now, for those who are smart ones, actually post your listings rate, they start to repost. to so always be on the top because the rest of the agents are not working. Correct. Your listing is always on top. Correct. Then you get the, all the calls. Okay. So don't give up. Right. Next. Digital marketing, you have to learn digital marketing. I think we have one uh, session that has done uh, way uh, in the beginning of uh, this, this uh, series. Okay, so you have to go back and trace back the video there, digital marketing. And then if you want to learn more, Facebook marketing. How can you approach and how at this point of time? Because why everyone is staying at home. So how else can they, how do you connect with them? It's only digitally and Facebook is one of them. Right, so you need to learn all these things. Okay, if you have the knowledge, take the next step. Okay, start your campaign. Right, then if you have not, uh, do not know how to do Facebook, then go to attend some external courses. Right, online now they have. Okay, go and search. Okay, so the next thing, just want to uh, touch on. Okay, for meetings with clients, example. When you have a client say that, hey, I want to meet up with you because I want to uh, market this property. So these are, the th these are the software that we use, the apps that we use, Google Meet, Zoom. I believe most of you here has already gone through at least one session of uh, Google Meet and Zoom. So uh, it's, it's different from live streaming. Huh? Okay? Live streaming means I talk, you listen. All right? So Google Meet means everyone can talk. Okay? Uh, like web market like that. Okay. Uh, virtual house tour okay, or virtual tours that you can use to actually let them know how it looks like. Okay, And then uh, when you need to do documentation for signing, okay, you can actually engage, uh, actually use e-signing. All right. So uh, later on, I will talk about this. What are the apps they can use? Okay. So next thing, the flow. Very simple flow. I, I break down the flow itself. So at this moment, because of the uh, service breaker, Okay, so how are we going to actually get buyers, sellers, tenants, uh, landlords together, right? So it is through Google Meet. Okay, then invite buyer and seller to into the uh, Google Meet, then do the viewing. It's called virtual house tour. Okay, virtual house tour. Okay, then of course you can do your own negotiation and then subsequently closing documentation. All right. Now, uh, so again, documentation later on, we touch on this, everything. So this is for uh, uh, just now one is uh, for the uh, resale. This is for the new sales. So again, set up Google Meet. OK, if let's say you are the uh, OK, either you're the non-core team or you're the tagger. OK, you need to set up the Google Meet, invite the parties into the Google Meet. All right. And then after that, uh, over there, discuss, OK, do a virtual tour of the property of the show flat of okay uh and and the uh, show suites itself okay upon doing the closing okay 
uh, talk to the IC. Okay, they will give you instructions on how to do the uh, deposit money transfer, uh, what are the paperwork that they require from the buyer, and so on and so forth. And then after that, how does this document is going to be sent across to your client? Okay, either by email if they're overseas or by WhatsApp, okay, whatever method, right? They will tell you. Okay, so basically it is possible. And frankly speaking, uh, I'm, I'm doing uh, many of the projects of uh, Orange Tea in Orange Tea itself every day that is closing okay every day that is closing right believe it or not uh, buyers are still buying and there are buyers who have not seen the show flat bought as well so there is always a possibility the only thing you need to do is connect with them right so next okay google meet what uh google meet i believe uh, many people has uh, used it already okay but if in case you have not used it then the first thing you need to do these are the few steps you need to do first of all uh use orange t email to log in then go to google calendar okay create an event so you need to say i want to do a meeting on which day okay set up the date and time for the meeting okay then after that, uh, set the Google Meet. There is one more, one more point. You need to do the Google Meet and then copy the link. It will, it will create a link. So that is the most important one. The link, that's where you send to your respective client, either to the buyer, seller, tenant, landlord, whoever. All right. Then they will come in together. Okay. So this is the screenshot how it looks like. Okay. So uh, the that's on top is the viewing of X condo for rent. And then you look somewhere in the center, you can see Google Meet, okay, with the green icon, uh, green color uh, little icon over there. So join with Google Meet, okay. So this is what is the most important that you need to actually sign out, okay, this link over here to your client. So the advantage of having Google Meet is, okay, uh, straightforward, okay, both parties, buyer, seller, okay connect through you only they do not have any other means of direct connection all right uh, with each other okay so it is through you because why there is no sharing of phone numbers okay so that's the biggest advantage of using zoom or google meet okay so that was a uh, google meet and then i will now uh, do a simple demonstration okay of how to create this google meet so like i said over here i just need to open my account uh, so my my uh, google uh, tab here so log into my account okay so go to this nine buttons here where all the apps will be available calendar so calendar for so example right now at this uh, today is first of may i want to meet my client Okay, at uh, maybe uh, later on, right now it's about three o'clock, so I want to meet him here at this time. Okay, so I just come over here, no title, you know, create an event over here. Okay, so at uh, meeting with XXX condo seller. Right, so 4.30 to 5.30, okay, that's fine. So what is the location? Here, at Google Meet Video Conferencing. This is what I want. So I just click on it, and then up to, it will tell you that this session up to 250. Yes, so you have now generated, uh, it will generate this code for you. Okay, so what you need to do is just expand, or you can just right mouse button, copy link, okay, in the in, in new tab, and then after that, uh, copy the link ready and then send to your clients. Okay, so ask them to be available and join you in this uh, uh, Google Meet at this time. All right, so it is that simple. It's very straightforward. You be the host. Okay, then you can actually uh, mute. Okay, later on I'll talk about it. All right, so now coming back, right? Very simple. Okay, Google Meet uh, with clients is very simple. Okay, next Zoom. Now, Zoom, initially, uh, when the circuit breaker started, I actually went into Zoom to actually uh, find out how to set up a meeting. So I, I have my friend uh, to, to test it out. Okay, So set up Zoom itself, you go to Zoom, or you, if you use the application, this this will be the uh, icon, Okay, the app itself. So once you go into to sign in, you can either use your Facebook account or Google Mail account, right? So uh, log in. Okay. 
And then after that, uh, there is a message. Uh, the, the session, because it's free, you did not sign up for, you know, you did not pay for it. So it's free usage, but there's a limit of a, a time limit of 40 minutes with uh, three or more participants. However, uh, just last night, I have another uh, Zoom session with my friends, uh, external friends. So uh, it's also free usage. My friend is, is uh, using a free account. And apparently, uh, Zoom right now allow users to use more than 40 minutes, okay? So last night, my session with my friends was like one and a half, one and a half hours, okay? So that is good news, right? But this message, 40 minutes time limit, the one whenever you are in Zoom, you will see that message. So, but anyway, you can also use Zoom, okay? Uh, another advantage of Zoom is that you can actually lock the uh, chat, the, the group chat, when the group has all the friends has come in already, uh, you can actually lock up the don't allow any any one external people to come in, you know, to 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 join the chat room. Okay, right. Okay, so that is the security part. Okay, so that is a uh, Zoom and uh, this uh, Google Meets. Okay, virtual house tours. So, example during this uh, period of time, someone call you and say that hey, uh, Mr. Ace Wong. I saw your credentials. I want you to sell my house. I want you to rent my house. Exciting or not? Exciting. But I cannot visit the house. So how? Okay. So this is a recommendation of the things that you can do. Okay. Uh, when you actually want to meet up with the new leads. So uh, example, recently we attended uh, one session with the uh, top close with the closers uh, during this period of time. Jasmine Chan actually shared with us the, uh, this uh, experience. Okay, homeowner actually want uh, has uh, has rented out current tenant want to leave. Okay, it's a penthouse, right? So uh, managed to get hold of the tenant and then she actually uh, advertised, uh, managed and get a few ten uh, prospect tenants come together. Okay, so prepare meeting uh, with homeowner or tenant. Okay, so at the same time, teach the right way of holding the phone where the owner or tenant should uh, position themselves or move themselves. So basically, it's like you ask them okay, to hold the phone. So assuming uh, this is uh, this is the view, uh, right? So you ask them to hold the phone upright, make sure it's upright. Then tilt up or move their hand up and down, left and right. So they can actually see the different part of the property uh, okay, clearly and uh, present it to the uh, tenant of the prospects. All right. Okay. It can be the buyer also, for all you know. All right, so uh, basically give very clear, simple uh, voice instructions and, and during the conducting of the virtual viewing, it can be done, right? And oh yeah, at the same time, uh, Jasmine said that she closed okay, without viewing the house, without meeting the client, uh, landlord and tenant. Okay, wonderful. Happens, huh? it can happen, all right? So this is something uh, I have done. I just want to share with you, okay, uh, first of all, I'm okay. So this is a video that I created for the sales of my HTB in Semming. Uh, a really so sorry, yeah, a really so. Okay. Okay, right. So it's a very short uh, virtual tour. Okay, this is also virtual tour. Basically, it's, it's a video. So what happens is, if you look on the right side, I have a series of uh, short videos, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, combine them together and created this uh, clip here. So uh, you see that I was moving from point to point. Okay, I was moving from point to point, And then after that, uh, next uh, video clip uh, at of the other part of the house. All right. So this is a very uh, a, a very simple way. Uh, also free of charge. Okay. Not not really free of charge. Okay. So anyway, uh, these are the tools that I use. The apps that I use to help me. Okay. iMovie, InShot, and Splice. Just for your information, Splice is charging me. Okay. I am paying for Splice. All right. So you have to be careful whichever apps that you download, okay? Make sure you check properly first. Okay, so you can combine uh, videos or combine videos and a photo put together, 
all right so that there is a is a continuous uh, video together and you can actually use this and then send out to whoever prospects okay especially especially nowadays so for those of you who have existing listing only with pictures you still can create a short video out of it you have to go and uh, download this app and then uh, learn okay using uh, learn okay, use youtube YouTube have a lot of how to do this, how to do that, ah, a lot, a lot, going fine, all right? So, uh, yeah, so this is something that I have done. And then, uh, okay, so next. Okay, so when it comes to uh, what are the advantages, okay, uh, previously before the COVID-19 itself, we all see the, uh, the advantage is that once we have done one video, we can re reuse it, means we can send. We can send to A, B, C, D, all the customers, all overseas, local, whoever, right? Okay, it's, uh, overseas customer can view remotely, okay? Uh, customers who are staying in the uh, opposite side of the island can also view it first before they decided if they want to view the actual property. So give a prospect a good idea of how the property looks like. Okay, so what I've done is because it's uh, for me is first time trying out. Uh, it's also HDB, so I don't mind. I just do DIY uh, all myself. Okay, but uh, if you have listings of landed houses or condominiums, you know, two three million kind of uh, value or even higher value, uh, please engage professionals. You don't want to make yourself xia sui, you know. Ah, uh, okay, right. So uh, the best part now is because. Virtual tour allows agent to work from home. Yes, I just send the link. Oh, you want? Okay, you want to see? Yes, uh, send to you. Send, send to you, send to you. Yeah, okay, can, can. No problem. Ah, okay, okay. So give me an offer and then we close the deal. So easy, right? Uh, comfort from the home. Why I say comfort is because you see now I have aircon, I have fan. What oh, very hot day, right? Ah, okay. So you see, comfortable, very comfortable. Mm. All right. And uh. Now that is for the resale part of it. Okay, virtual tour right now, we're talking about show flats, which means uh, new sales. Okay, so new sales um, over here. Developers understood the importance of reaching out to overseas customers. So they created the tours for all uh, respective show suites and also drone area view with uh, site plans uh, superimposed. Okay, so uh, developers has already invested this kind of money. Okay. So at the same time, so therefore we can actually make use of all these uh, tools. These are tools for us right now, okay, to help us to reach out. Because uh, when someone say, "Hey, you have anything to show me or not?" So besides the pictures that you have taken, you can actually show this a very professionally done kind of uh, virtual tour. All right. So you have to uh, you can actually use this. Uh, let me show you drone area view. What is it about? Okay. So uh, with this, basically it gives the prospect a general understanding of the uh, surrounding. Okay, so virtual tour itself, example of superimposed uh, site plans. So, uh, yes, I am the uh, IC for dairy farm. Okay, one of the ICs of dairy farm. So, I have to use this example. So, I use this example. So, this is the site itself, the boundary itself, the site is like L shape. And then the site map itself was superimposed. This is taken from the uh, drone view. Okay, I will do a demonstration later on. Okay, so that, and that's how it looks like. Okay, so in here you can see the orientation of all the units uh, of all the uh, where can I, the, where is the facilities where are the facilities okay over here majority and then where are the residential site okay right and then the surroundings are what you know so it gives a very good idea right so the next thing okay virtual tour demonstration okay so first thing first is that uh, okay. Uh, our RPT department uh, has already uh, consolidated this list here. You can find uh, inside your Orange T agent app. Okay, so don't worry. Uh, Orange agent app is already there. Okay, so first thing, just now I mentioned about dairy farm. So I'm going to show you overview. So overview itself uh, refers to the drone view. Uh, okay, so uh, over here, this itself will have two levels of view one is called a bird's eye view so super high this is bird's eye view so you can see that we have the uh Bukitima Re nature reserve over here. this is the uh, catchment here okay um then Bukitima nature reserve dairy farm is here Bukitima is here uh mbs okay cbd okay this is fun mbs cbd yeah uh, i want to look into that area you can see now i zoom in Wow, I can see MBS. Ah. Wow. Okay. So, right. So, that's the advantage. 
Okay, so all this has been marked out okay, by the vendor, right? And then here, if you look, uh, move it downwards, okay? This is how the site plan looks like, okay? And then the surroundings and so on, all right? So this is the uh, drone view or the area view itself, okay? Then next, okay, uh, I want to talk, look at the show suites. So uh, I uh, one of my favorites one is a treasure at Tampines, okay? So this is not a training, uh, but just to show you. Now, one thing is once you click on to these um, virtual tours, you can see there is also this link over here, URL, uh, basically. So you can actually uh, copy this URL. If you want to send, you can send to your client, respective client. Okay, so the one to demonstrate today, I am going to use this uh, three bedroom premium, okay, uh, the treasure, right? It's only 1033 square feet. Okay, so let's start the tour. So developers uh, engage different, like I said, different uh, vendors have uh, different uh, different ways of presenting these virtual tours. So uh, over here itself, I, let me go to the entrance first. All right. So there are a few things I just want to show you with you. For this vendor itself, they have incorporated the plan, okay? The unit uh, floor plan over here. So at this moment, you can see the all the dots are actually location of the uh, uh, virtual tour uh, camera, okay, the 360 camera. So these are the position and right now I'm over here. So if I were to tilt to this side uh, to take a look back, okay, this is the door entrance. Okay, Mr. Bayer, this is the door entrance and coming in here, you have your uh, distribution. So this is where I can start my presentation. You know, assuming, imagine that right now, three of us, uh, the, the client, myself, uh, are in, in this uh, Google Meet. Okay, so once I click here, yeah. all right. So coming in here, first thing you see is that it's an enclosed kitchen. So there's sliding door over here, and then let's take a look at the kitchen, right? So uh, top and bottom cabinets on one side with the wash basin, and then the other one is also top and bottom cabinets all installed for you, okay, with the oven, with the uh, hooker and the hob. Put and the hob is over here, all right. So we are using pipe gas for this three bedroom. Okay, so, you, so you can see all these are open fire. So you want to zoom in a little bit? Yes, you can, right? Show them, okay? The only thing we cannot show is open the door. Oh, cannot, cannot open the door, sorry. <laughs> okay, so uh, over here, you follow, you can also follow, take a look at the yard, I mean the, the floor plan over here, there's the yard. So this is a dry yard over here and behind is the air con latch. On this side is oh, uh, WC. Okay, there is an entrance, one more entrance over here to a utility. So over here, Mr. Buyer, right? So you can always co-relate, okay, co-relate from the floor plan and to the actual one, how it looks like, okay? And then the dryer that is a provider here is a two-in-one, okay? Right, two-in-one. Okay, so Mr. Buyer, so right now, let's go over to our dining. So what impressed me, okay, Mr. Buyer, this uh, dining set itself, you see, we can comfortably put in a six-seater dining set, okay? Compared to design nowadays, okay, this is very luxurious, spacious design, okay? Thanks to the 40 years of a business, uh, Simlian has uh, started with a building, uh, you must mention uh, the developer, uh, Simlian itself, they, themselves, they are uh, started as a builder, and now subsequently for the last 10 years or so, they, are be, they have the license to become developers and for them they emphasize on interior layout okay so you can see you can enjoy a very comfortable spacious okay, dining uh, uh, experience over here very comfortable and wide feeling on the living area so wall to wall is about three meters okay so let's take a look at the bedroom point to the bedroom two here Okay, so this is designed for children. So there's a three steps uh, like tatami and then also storage space below. Okay, and then if, uh, if you want, this one is like a super single. Uh, no, it's just a double, but if you want a queen size, you can actually extend over here another four more inches over here. All right, so there's enough space because our wardrobe is actually sliding door, right? All the way to the top. Can you see? All the way to the top. All right, so very spacious uh, accommodation. Uh, bedrooms over here and the master bedroom oh i can tell you mr buyer oh see this is actually somewhere around queen size big because you know two uh pillow side by side queen size two below p 
pillows side by side with extra space. Ah, king size. Okay, so they put queen size, but there is enough space on both sides okay, to put in a king for you. And just imagine your wardrobe is side by side with the bed itself. Ah, so you know how long is this wall? Very long. Uh, okay, so uh, very spacious designs, layout, uh, everything. Also very comfortable space and uh, very user-friendly uh, toilets. Okay, attached bath. Uh, not to forget one more thing. Okay, over here. Uh, should you have a uh, you know young baby okay that is enough space for your baby cot so don't worry about it all right okay so okay so basically uh, this is uh now let's take a look a quick look at the third bedroom itself okay so a customized bedroom now if you notice this the this customized bed below is actually another pull out single bed so basically you have two single bed pull out side by one top and one bottom enough space right so basically over here a lot of buyers upgraders especially they like this kind of feeling uh hence therefore within one year okay treasure has sold more than a thousand one hundred units okay so is it worth to buy i think it's very worthy to buy let's do our paperwork right now okay so uh now uh the other thing is uh depends on the vendor this vendor actually uh, uh, at the bottom of this screen, you can see a row of uh, buttons over here. Okay, so you have the but left button to go to the left, pen to the right, pen to the top, pen to the bottom. So in case you are not familiar with the, using the mouse or not comfortable with using the mouse, you have these pointers here. So you can zoom in, zoom out, okay? And this four square on the left will actually allow you to skip okay, directly to the other part of the house. So, uh, Maybe someone is asking, oh, wait, 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 just now in the bedroom itself, uh, there is something I want to see again. So you can actually jump back. Or you can use this um, uh, map over here, the floor plan over here directly, okay? Uh, over this uh, this little icon here, basically is for your virtual, okay? Goggles, goggles, all right? So uh, I don't have it here, so different. And therefore, uh, these are the tools that you can use. So be very familiar with, okay? Uh, for for you can get familiar, especially the core teams and the taggers. Please be familiar with the uh, the uh, what you call it, the virtual tours of the respective show flats. All right. Uh, if let's say you are not familiar of that, doesn't matter. Always engage a tagger or the IC of the property of the uh, development or the project itself. They are more than willing to set up the Google Meet with and then inviting you to come in and. We we'll meet up with our client together. All right, we are. They are here to help you, so don't worry about it. Okay, your com, you will still get your full com. There's no sharing. Don't worry. All right. So this is the virtual tour uh, for the uh, show flights uh, example. So I have, okay, come over here. Then now the next thing I just want to share with you. All right. Let's get back to my. Okay. So virtual tour done. Ready. Hello. Hello. Yes. Right, so uh, OTT agent apps itself in our handphone. Okay, so uh, how do we get hold of the information? Okay, uh, first log in already. There is a project marketing on the on this little icon here. So the next page you will see is okay. You have a whole a lot of things over there. So project project virtual tours. Okay, the next screen will come up. Is exactly what I just show you. This this file here. So you can actually uh, go inside, tap on each and every one of the links, okay, look at the virtual tour, play around with it, okay, and then uh, have an understanding. So, but the best person, if you are non-core team of that project, okay, the best person is to engage a tagger or the IC, all right? They know the product very well, okay? Then the other part of it is how to get the tagger. So same thing, uh, project marketing over here, okay? And then after that, there's a get tagger. Uh, then after the whole list of tagger come out already. La. Then you see la, who is the more familiar faces one. La. Uh, oh, who is the more familiar faces one. Okay, okay and someone you know la, more. All right. <laughs> okay, so this is the uh, agent app itself. Okay, so now last part, it will be in case of uh, you need to do documentation. Okay, so I'm going to touch on uh, sim some part over here for for those who are doing resale, rental, uh, sales, or resale itself, okay, prepare all necessary documents with names of sellers and buyers type on it. Okay, so all depends. Huh? Um, 
in some cases whereby if you were to send email to them or send email or send whatsapp to them soft copy okay uh some some people are not so comfortable they prefer to have the physical copy then no choice you have to you know prepare print it out and then get a courier service to send to them okay then after that courier back to you again and the kind of thing right so uh the other way will be either when you have it on the pdf you can actually use a acrobat okay the app is called acrobat okay uh to to type in the name and everything so you don't have to do scanning over here um if you have uh, the physical one no choice okay you print out already then fill up you have to scan then you can scan it okay use another app um uh, those scanning apps okay to convert it to pdf file and then send out again right so send to the respective party for e-signing so in cases only when uh the let's say the uh uh party you know, the buyer or seller whoever requires a physical one for them to sign then you prepare and get a courier service okay uh example one of them is lala move if you know of any other courier service ask your friends you know ask from from your colleagues or around your colleagues okay all right and then pay for the service no choice lah uh then uh in case there is any deposit that need to be uh transferred to the uh seller uh or landlord or even developers okay so you, they have to transfer the uh money directly to the uh, uh seller buyer the seller landlord or developers after receiving okay then the documents will come out i mean then you send the documents out right okay so that would be a recommended uh kind of uh, steps over here okay so uh, for developers again when it comes to uh, new sales or you know uh, project sales okay don't worry the taggers and ic's are there to help you they will give you the clear instructions step by step okay what are the things to do all right um give them a little bit of time because developer also need to some time to respond Okay, their staff need some time to respond also. Okay, so this is uh, the documentation part, right? And uh, if you want to find out, the last one is called, okay, I mentioned about Acrobat. So download this one into your, either your laptop, your handphone, okay, uh, Android also, okay? So start using it, understand how it works. Um, the feel and sign, yes, that's the function that is your is our concern right now. So the feel and sign, the one at this moment is free of charge, no need to pay. Okay, there are many other functions there that require you to pay. So be very careful. All right. So this is the um, my recommendation. Now, um, if you want to know how to do e-signature um, online uh, under YouTube, please do some search in YouTube. There is a series of them. Let me just show you. Okay, over here in my um, okay, over here. Okay, so what happened is this: I have done a search just now. So share with you here. Okay, how to sign PDF document on iPhone in the YouTube itself. So uh, you can skip this field because it's all advertisement. Okay, over here, how to sign? All right. So over here, there are many, many of uh, these tutorials so you can just go up and find out okay so uh, using pdf in your iphone right so basically that's what happens then that's how i do it as well all right so uh, just to share with you recently i just do a rental uh yeah rental closing okay so same thing like everything uh is exactly what i explained to you and how i described to you earlier on okay get the tenant and buyer to uh, tenant and uh, landlord to come in okay landlord is the one who is doing the house showing Okay, because uh yeah in cases where some some people say the house is empty so the owner don't stay there then how uh then you have to you you really have to ask the owner to go to the house because only he can go to the house at this moment because of the COVID 19. he can go to the house and ask him to do recording you can also tell um you know do a live session of uh, google meet with him Okay, and then after that, do a recording of the property over there. All right, or basically when he's there, then invite the tenant to be there, then he can actually show the house uh, immediately. All right, so that is how it can be done. Okay, so uh, at the same time, yeah, my, my clients also sign all electronically. I was doing everything at home. I didn't even go out, okay, 
aircon is on yeah yesterday very hot no the day before okay so uh yeah all right so let's see what is next okay so uh yeah that is uh, that brings to the end of my presentation thank you okay i wish everyone healthy stay healthy stay home uh, uh remember to wash your hand with soap all right okay and then uh we have one more month to go last few words here we have one more month to go until the first of june okay so uh take this time to learn something new okay uh at the same time, apply your knowledge. Okay, keep on doing the posting, reposting, whatever. Uh, if you don't want to do the posting, then re reposting in Property Guru. Then create new this thing, create new, then delete old one. That kind of thing, lah. Okay. So anyway, um, uh, so uh, okay, stay positive. Keep on going. The business, uh, you know, the 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 earth does not stop moving because of COVID nineteen. Okay. So we should always be moving up, uh, moving forward. Um, talk to your customer. Cost, no, talk to your customer. If you need some more motivation, you need a leave a hand uh, in, to help you on something. Talk to your manager. All right. Talk to your manager. Okay. So uh, it comes to the end. Thank you for your time. All right. I just hope that uh, uh, there's something that you can uh, use. Okay. And then uh, all the best. See ya.